Today is June 28th, 2024. Yeah, I can wait on the moment so I'm going to hold that next to my windows down and the cars are driven by and I'm going through everything uh, they were setting up at age. You go through the case in 19. Though actually where they kept saying in 18 is funny she doesn't know what they're doing. They're telling you how they frame it. And they frame it. And we brought her up. We told her to say this. We told her to told her say that. I told you about the old man that showed up within the first 45 days for every item that you tell her was. I'll turn it on. Right when it comes. Or go with a big bruise on my leg. Throw it on. Okay? That day. Went down to Walmart 62 Wood Forest. He said, you know that bruise right? He said, for every item word you tell him, I'll turn it on you. You try to leave Dave. Unless your child wants to work for Dave. You know that bruise on your leg. It's about the half the size of a lemon. Throw it off that one. I use sodium pentothal. No, he broke in my home and stabbed me with another day, but he broke another one of my mom's. Okay? He said, you know what you told me? No, I never talked to him. He stabbed me in my sleep. He said, you were wearing this one nightgown. You bent over him probably once and accidentally seen your mud. And you had a life of pain because of it. You tried to leave the ballast your child lost your mind. <clears throat> I got away from him. Got home to a legally fucked house. Had deep in I was wearing a grandma nightgown down on my knees, underwear, house coat, and they only made fun of the back of my knees, and I didn't even own that nightgown. Either. He admitted in front of the cops he had been drugging me out. He worked for Dave. That was the whole scam. Hmm? And telling me to lie under drugs. In the first 45 days, they knew Dave hired him. Hey, you were drugging on me up and down this lies. They start laughing. They photoshopped all their lies from filming up white piece above the toilet, raising some kind of press on the room. All kinds of crazy crap. Laughing, but it's funny she doesn't know what we're doing. It's funny she doesn't actually know what's going on. And they're telling everybody how they frame it. Around Thanksgiving of 18. Now, where I called the FBI and that agent opened up a case. Okay. We all have police and investigators around. Let's find out your involvement. They came up to me in Walmart 62. Melissa's so stupid she made everything up when you were fishing with Dave. She's actually that stupid. She didn't know where you were. I'm like, great. And then the different lies. Okay. Right after Thanksgiving of 18, the two undercover, two of my undercover cops that I have watched me since then were around me in the front of the store. Why they haven't all those kids make all that shut up? Oh, they're just trying to scare her out of the house. That's it. We interviewed her whole family. They spoke very highly of her. Okay. June 23rd to July 4th of 21. Same times. What are these people talking about? We interviewed her whole family a long time ago. She's never heard anyone. The girls that dated the drug dealers. Oh my goodness, the boys had a drugger to make her say that stuff. Nobody mentioned those tapes again when we were out. They were the same cops. March 23rd, 23. Walmart 62 came and screamed at these people. We told these people to stay out of this. We interviewed her whole family a long time ago. She's never heard anybody and nobody's ever seen anything. It's just some lady trying to make money out of this. Not an attorney, some lady. Or the drugger time. They made up a scam that a district attorney gave them permission. If you Google what a district attorney is, it's a federal prosecutor for the Department of Justice that puts people in jail for breaking constitutional laws. They think if they put big names on it, they can get away with it. Just like they told people they took their stalking tapes of the drug confessions, 
bear had all the bruises all over me, throwing up, heart racing, severely impacted. I'm being sexually abused by the cartel. I've been throwing up, headache, almost passing out, giant bruises, muscle pain, going to the doctor all summer long. I don't know what's wrong with me. I know that well water's dirty, I'm showering in. But I, don't, I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't remember a thing. What just happened to you? They were sleepwalking under the stars, and they were beating and raping me and abusing me. Okay? Think it's funny? Do you want them to do it to you? Hmm? Zero rape was spraying on you like that when a sex extortion came? Okay? They lied. There was no district attorney can't give them rights or permission to break the law. They're the ones that uphold the law and put people in jail for breaking it. Got it? And they prosecute them. You can't get special little Tico Bell permission to break the law. No man's above the law. I'm in immunity and I wouldn't think twice. I wouldn't even dare even think of breaking the law. That's where Officer Mark told some other officers we'll give Karen no wrongdoing in life because he knew she wouldn't abuse it. Another officer uh, will set it up after what those people did to her. No one will ever touch her the rest of her life legally. See, that's where my friend from the prosecutor's office, you don't understand, Karen. There's several witness protection programs. You're in one. And until the FBI puts you in another witness protection program, you'll be in employment for life. Or he said life of peace is an employment. Nothing legally stated, dated against you again. He said, and you stay in immunity the rest of your life for working the case. Hmm? The way that agent set it off. Or even when you tell. You have that money to live on. Da, 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 da. Meant to know what I'm doing. I'll take care of everything in that. And then left me up there. Uh huh. But he set up the case and took my money and just fed me to. <sighs> Get it? Oh, they made a, a scenario that they took their stocking tapes, done by the drug hotel, in a sex extortion scheme. Photoshopped up, washing, laughed in my face. Okay. Drug confessions. And they entered it in court. Found me guilty and nobody told me. People fell for that. Made up this big word, and it was called sexual imposition. God, I didn't even. And they said it means weird with yourself. I googled it around Christmas of twenty-one. It means rape. They used a big dirty word that nobody met, knew what it meant. It means rape. My God, that never happened. They lied to people what it meant. I went into this restaurant. That guy, some guys were in there. She had to Google what it meant. Now this is funny. They said she was found guilty in court of it. Him, not even on a good day. Don't even have an accusation of it. They lied to you. I went down to Walmart today. Cars are driving by, this girl pulls in next, gets walking around a car. Oh, my window. So, I start uh, going through everything. Okay. That girl got back in her car, said they made everything up. Oh, honey, you're slow. They said they made everything up in 18. They've been bullshitting all you people. Where were you June, around June 30th, 23, July 2nd or 23 last year? They said they went to a party and they were live at the party, how big a fools all you are for falling for this. And mocking all you people how huh? you fell for it. Or June 7th, 23, where they made fun of FBI agent John, how they pulled him. Where were you last weekend? Uh, on the strip where the guys said they think that Karen's world is stupid. Hmm? Where Eric confessed to all the tapes and for were him and not me and done for a stunt for people to turn on me and they fell for it. Uh, November 18th, 22. 
where were you? May 25th, 21, 8, 9, 21. Uh, November 1st to 3rd of 21. December 9th, 21, twice. January 19th, 22. Uh, February 2nd, 22, it'd be in dropped and told to say it. Minute of frame in May, March 24th, 22. March 1st to 3rd of 21, where they said they put clips together and made a porn. It wasn't me, it was them. Mm -hmm. And then May 12th, 22, and May 26th, 22. At noon, uh, the shower scenes in the other room to make me look weird, and they found a tape of um, them admitting to a shower scene in the other room. Hmm. Or in March of 22, that it was ordered by Pete that uh, everything be drugged, photoshopped, and made up on me. And then December 9, 21, all the tapes were for with them not heard, and it was done first on, or uh, I'll take it back. All the tapes before were them and not her. What's going on? It's just a group of men doing as many crimes as they can to see if someone will actually stop them. It's a car town, and they don't think they're stoppable. Same day, white man ball with dark eyes disturbing food at the Stark County Hunger Task Force on 9th Street. was one of my guards. We always knew the tapes before were them and not her. So we never said a word. We can go back to May 24th, 26th, or 24th. Officers that were watching me that day talked to some lady and told them it's ridiculous for anybody to ever insult her. She almost died to save children, and they knew the whole time that their backup plan, if she didn't die, was stocking tapes of photoshopping and washing to make her look weird, and they knew it was photoshopped. And they already knew they drugged her and told her to say it before. And it was her backup plan if she didn't die to extort money on things from her. Hmm? Hmm? How many times, let's see, in August of 23 on a Tuesday, Officer Mark said it was already documented or framed by the drug cartel? See, what was it, April 26th of 24? Uh, Walmart Strip, officer in uniform. We all know it was a cartel in your home before. Nobody else drugs anybody. It's a big drug scam for me. My ex husband hired the drug dealers. You're mocking me for some drug dealers running a scam. And where they kept saying it's funny, she doesn't know what's going on, it's so funny. And then 19. Some guys from the drug war said they're exposing corrupt law enforcement publicly. That's what they're doing. Then another guy said they set him up to be arrested. They were after FBI agent John the whole time to exploit him. That's what was so funny. As if the drug cartel would ever help an FBI agent. There are enemies. One are serial killers and child molesters. And the other guy is the one that puts him in jail for it arch enemies. They were setting them up and they think he's stupid. And they already made a pull up on June 7th, 23. FBI agent John fell for the stun of tapes before. Oh, come on, that was only a stun. You're kidding. Is that what's going on? FBI agent John fell for the stun of tapes before. Ha ha ha. They saw videos of it. About hail stole from heaven. The pastors confessed. They dared the FBI July 9th, 23, the cartel in Trinity Gospel came in. The FBI wouldn't dare fix it. I'm like, you're daring the federal government? I've been waiting for a response. They were talking in September in, of 23 up in. Akron, she do anything wrong? No. The drug dealers made fun of the FBI for falling for this. None of this is funny. Are they going to do anything about it? We don't know. But they made fun of the FBI for falling for it. And the cartel, the drug dealers already admitted everything was them. And they photoshopped everything. Hmm? And I asked her, ask her husband, did they, did those doc did they ever tell that the medicine was making her sick before and it was medication errors? And he said yes. And they did tell him to sue those doctors. 
And he let all those people hurt her and didn't say a word. None of this is funny. Hmm? Exactly. Last March or April, maybe, oh, I'd say May to June of last year, I was up in Akron. Started a new a client. The police up there were knocking on the door and saying, Have you, they all know they sell water. Have you ever listened to Karen before? I said, Yes. Well, we don't want you to say anything to her. We already know everything's photoshopped. Then how do you do it? We don't know, but we've already verified everything's photoshopped. They're driving the hell out of me, that's what they were doing. Everything's digital. Hmm? And they were wondering if it was an Agent John. Did she ever mention an Agent John? He said his last name. He said yes in the beginning of the case a lot. We were wondering if it wasn't him. Hmm? They were sent, like I said, they sent him up to be arrested. And they were supporting corrupt law enforcement in this area. Think about it. That's what was so funny. 19, they actually sat at Walmart. That's where they found it, Hartville, last Thursday. And then Akron, they did say they set him up. Oh, they set him up to be arrested. That's what they said. And they did say they were supporting um, uh, corrupt law enforcement in this area publicly. They were trying to take that agent down. That's why they all hopped out. I love both of us.